this area is so boring now. If there was a way to modify it. Stop! I know Unreal Engine. Why don't I make this area in 3D? So the first step was to make a snake. It should be easy, right? I made this ball follow a cursor, of course without any bugs. Then I started making a snake body. After trying to do this by myself, I decided to search the internet for some help. But the problem was that there are no any tutorials about making smooth snake movement in Unreal Engine. So the only option was to embrace the dark side and watch Unity tutorials. But they didn't help me much. Then I found this project on the internet and wanted to modify it for my game, but when I saw this code, I closed that project and continued searching for a solution. So, after a day of suffering and trying to figure out snake movement by myself, I accidentally found this game and luckily it was made with Unreal Engine. So, I decided to steal... <coughs> I mean, use some code in my own project, but after I remade snake movement, I found a little performance issue. When the snake was too long, FPS dropped heavily, and to fix this, I had to completely remake my snake using instance static mesh component. Oh, let's go! Let's go! So, one more day after, I implemented snake movement again, but now it worked perfectly. Then I decided to boost like an original game, and it was time to add some food. So I created a new ball, but now it's food, and I had to make it collide with my snake. What can go wrong? I spent one day and billion nerve cells to finally understand that collision doesn't work at all. And so I came up with the idea of using ray casting. And some bugs after, the system was done. Also the food should be spawned, so I quickly made spawn system. Then I realized how terrible the game looks and decided to improve the situation. Firstly, I made this red food material. After that, I started making hexagon floor like in Slytherio. I just took hex material from starter content, changed it a little bit and yeah, the floor was done. Then I came back to food, made it glowing, smaller, implemented random colors, made eating more satisfying and added death. After all of that, I found some inspiration and made 9 skins for the snake. Like solid color, glowing color and hexagons. And it's only 9.99 per- Then I set random scale to food, but after all of that I found a little bug breaking the whole game. So the less FPS I had, the smaller the snake was. I tried to figure out the problem by myself, but I ended up asking for help on Reddit and Unreal Engine forum. After many discussions, the best thing I managed to do is that. I know it still shrinks, but at least not as much as before. And I especially want to thank this guy from Reddit and this guy from Unreal Engine forum for their help. If you have any ideas how to solve this problem, you can write them in the comments below. Thank you in advance. At this stage I had feeling that something important is missing. But what is it? Oh, of course, it's player interface. So I quickly made this text where you can see your length and your rank. And it seems that my game is full of skilled players because my personal rank record is 999 out of 999. <laughs> then I made main menu with possibility to change your skin. And yeah, that's not Slytherio, it's Slido. Also, I improved the environment, enabled RTX, made some minor improvements and that's the final result. If you want me to continue working on this game, let me know in the comments below. I really spent much time and efforts on it, so I will continue only if I see that you like such content. Otherwise, man, fuck this shit. Link to download this game in the description. Thanks for watching and subscribe or the snake will eat you.